Hello everyone and welcome back to another video where I will be doing another island tour. And the theme of this island is Bridgerton. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I know of the series, but I have personally never watched it. Elegant regal builds and I do really appreciate those. It's been a while since I've seen an island with that kind of theme. And like always, I will include the journal address down below if you guys were interested in touring this island. And I will include all the creator information and the information for my Instagram where I'll be putting my favorite parts of this island on. And like always, we are going to start off at the airport and we will take a look at the map. So we do have one main home. And a residential area, which is really nice. I do like the layout of this map. It's very clean. And I do love all the cherry blossoms i tried to find something that was a little you know dainty regal but um this is all i had and i brought a sword with me to protect myself um because you know i feel like this takes place sometime in the 1800s oh my gosh look at this courtyard it looks like a union jack it's stunning um on oh, the, the horse-drawn carriages but um yeah i feel like this island takes place in most likely the 1800s so you know i feel like that's a Appropriate. I don't have a musket or anything, so best thing I got is a sword. Got the little beach. Ooh, elegant paintings. Little painting class here, very artsy. Oh, we got here a little camping area. Oh, bee farm. Oh, ride mon bicyclette. Kind of looks like I'm sniffing the seat, but that's okay. Oh, I wish I could have. See, they put the flowers as the basket, but I wish I could put my face in there and be like, E.T. Kind of cool. Oh, I like this little build here. Just small little buildings. I love that. Also love the paving and all the courtyards. Very Ooh, what do we got down here? Oh, the Able Sisters. Oh, look at these gowns. Gorgeous. Makes me want to hop in me carriage. And clip clop about the town. Also, did not realize that there's this gorgeous paving underneath the statue and some butterflies. Let me just yoink and see what was in here. A bamboo wand. What were y'all doing with a bamboo wand? Interesting. Interesting. I'm not gonna question you, ladies. I'm just gonna keep moving. Love this little courtyard. Hmm, what do we got up here? Oh, more buildings. So stunning. Love that with the little troughs out front. Ooh. I like that with the ivy kind of growing all around the front. And what do we have over here? I'm assuming that these are all homes of the characters in the series. Oh, hello. Flawless my God bless. That's literally how I talk to my friends. So I said flawless, babe. But um, love it. So let's see if there's any posts. No, oh, I love that they continued all the little building faces behind the residential services. Uh, the Credit Island did mention there's a lot of gifts to be picked up, so you can use a lot of handhelds when you come to visit. So I'm gonna pick up these. Oh, parasol. Ah, oh, if only I packed a parasol instead of a sword. Okay, so our girl comes in clutch here. She does have an elegant gown for us. Stunning. Lacy parasol. Oh, gorgeous. Do you want to wear the prom tiara? No, I like my tiara hair more. What else do we have here? Chic mum crown. Mm, no, we're gonna go with this one. Perfect. Oh, we have another courtyard space. We'll go around and appreciate it a little bit more. Oh, gorgeous. I like how my dress matches with the blue, uh, little purple mums there. Oh, I like how everything has like a floral aspect, like it's so dainty. Oh, and this clown over here, my goodness, okay. Ruined it for me, mate, but um, let's 
keep going. Ooh, cleaning Tower of Pisa here. Kind of like a, with a white dove. Kind of like someone's getting married. Oh, I have a little shit. Damn, there's a wedding cake here. Is this a wedding chapel? Interesting. Interesting. I'm going to try and piece it together. We have a lot of honeybees pollinating the flowers. Making honey. But yeah, I'm going to try and figure out what the theme of the series is based on what's going on in the builds here. So let's go take a look and... Stunning. Stunning. Are we not seeing this? Gorgeous. Love the courtyard out front. Let's take a look inside. Oh, it's two spiral staircases. Stunning. Oh, we have a little study here. Gorgeous. Oh, we have a little bed. Little dresses hanging around. I like that little candle on the side of the wall kept true to the theme. Because I do believe we're taking place in the 1800s in this one. Oh, we have another guest bedroom over here. Oh, this looks like it belongs to some gentleman with his little suit on the side. Fancy, fancy. Got the crust up top. Oh, look at this. Play a little piano. Yeah, you know, I feel like that song was very popular at the time. I'll have myself a grape. Lounge on the Shea Lounge. Hmm. Oh, right, let's check out the basement. Oh, big dining area. Very fancy. Love the green. I'll help myself to this pie pie. Delicious. Interesting. Alright, let's head up. Okay, let's keep on moving. Take one more second to appreciate this. Stunning. Oh, so we gotta get across this bridge over here. Oh, we have the museum. Love it with all the ivy and grapes everywhere. Oh, we have some papers over here. Oh, and a unicorn. Interesting. Unicorn at the secret beach. Looks like a printing press. They're making books or newspaper. I'm not sure. Some kind of publication. Hmm. Oh, look at that. It's so good. I like that with the little centerpiece down there with all the rocks. Oh, have ourselves a little treat. Anyone home? Oh, wow, two. Back to back. All right, let's go take a look-see. Oh, hello. Very yellow. Interesting. All right, let's head out. Oh, play a little music on the harp. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do -do -do. Oh, yeah, where was I here? So, pie, then this house is next. Oh, hello, Punchy. Punchy, there's like barely anything in this house. Crazy. Love it. He has a little suit, and the house we were in previously had a little. Oh, he has two little suits. Yeah, the house we were in previously had like a little gown, so you know, everyone's like in their little civilian plebeian clothes, and then when no one's looking, they have their little suits and ball gowns. Oh, another little tea spot here. Let's head on up. Who is home? Oh, okay, we got one over there. Let's crack this baby open. Gorgeous, whatever that was. Okay, let's go. Which one of yours was home again? You, okay. This one. Oh, hello. Oh, I'll help myself to this hot bath over here and slide in the shower. I'm just gonna flood your house. 
Oh, for a second there, I thought her bed was just like this towel on the floor for a second. Oh my god, that would be so funny. But I really appreciate the paving and the symmetry. Like the way the creator- oh, look at that. Right in the center. Like the way the creator was able to center out even like their main courtyard right by the airport. Oh, but that was so satisfying. Because there's nothing worse than having something not line up. Oh, what do we have down here? We have some shops. It's a little tea shop. Oh, someone home over here. Oh, hello. Oh, Jesus. Rude. I like her purple pearl bed, though. Looks velvety. Very elegant. Got her little crown there and her little, little gown. And this, I believe, yeah, because this is the main courtyard. So let's check on over here. I love this little bake shop. Ooh, you are home as well. Oh, this is elegant little- Oh, look at this little suit on the side. Like, it's very elegant in here. Like, this little, uh, well-to-do little suit. I like this. Little, little bag. Or maybe like a box. Like a flower box. Oh. Like how everything is like the wedding-themed items. Oh, and everyone's on a doily. They're like, please use a coaster wherever you're standing. Oh, I like this too, with the little flower pattern underneath the statue. Oh, got some flamingos, pearls. They're at a little oasis. And another wedding venue. Is everyone trying to get married in this show? I think, I think, I'm pe- It's a strong theme. There's a lot of courtyards, a lot of- elegant buildings and everyone is just trying to get married. What about the little pink campsite here? Oh, is this another wedding venue? Oh, it's like a dance hall. Maybe some guy is asking me to dance with him so we can be courting. And we do a little, little one of these, like a slow little circle. And I do a curtsy and I move on to the next man, like we're speed dating. But then he gets jealous and I go back to him and he tries to wife me and tell me about all of his riches and how he is a fantastic prospect. But in reality, he has syphilis and he's trying to give me syphilis, which if this really is the 1800s, it was very popular at the time. Believe me, I have a master's degree in public health. All that was facts, by the way. Anyone wondering? Oh. And someone is writing a book. I'm convinced. Maybe it's gonna be like Sex in the City. Maybe this is the 1800s version of Sex in the City. Oh, the horse-drawn... Ooh, it's the big carriages now. Dang. wonder who they hauling. Important people, that's for sure. Important people with syphilis. <laughs> Anywho. Uh, let's keep on looking. Oh, what do we got? A little swing. That's cute. The little letters. Have I been up here? I don't think so. Oh, I love this. Everything is at like a cute angle. Nothing is just straightforward. It's just beautifully decorated. Oh, okay. So that leads us to... The shops down there in the little residential area. Ooh, what is this? Everyone's having these little secret picnics everywhere. I'm convinced. And they're just doing their little crafts. What is this? Needlepoint? Needlepoint, painting, writing a book, running a bee farm. The women here must be busy. So, I am going to take one more final sweep of this island and make sure I didn't miss anything. I will be back. Alright everyone, this is the end of the island tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really appreciated the builds on this island. I thought they were all stunning. Like the one behind me? Gorgeous! A lot of detail went into them. Um, I love the patterns and I love all the different little... Like terraforming was absolutely fantastic. So overall, I do believe that Bridgerton, if I'm pronouncing that right, is about women in the 1800s 
trying to get married, and they carry out little hobbies. I'm sure there's like some little scandalous moments in there, but that is what I am gathering. And these people are very well-to-do. I'm going to assume they're all well-to-do people. Let me know, let me know how close I am in the comments. I'm not going to look up what it's about. I want to hear from you guys. And like always, dream address, create information in my Instagram, all in the description below. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.